on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Remember, Eisen, that son of a bitch. <laughs> Wait, what's this feeling? Spirit energy, I as then, yeah, she pretty much runs right up. To a four year old Izuku, pretty much terrifying her parents considering she just left. Are you alright? Uh, uh, and then the other three show up! Tear? Uh, wait. You think you're here too? Yeah, but why do you look so young? Uh, why do you look so... Them looking and they are referred to children. As they just look at these videos. So, seemingly you follow the... Yeah, for some reason this kid... Uh, who are you? Uh... Who are you? My name is Izuka Madoya. Well... Uh, nice to meet you. Can you explain what you're doing here? Helping. Then just look at each other. It's more like you just got your butt whooped. Someone's being bullied and I stopped them. Hmm. Interesting. Well. <clears throat> why don't you use your Spirit power. What? Yeah, spirit energy, you know. You seem to have a lot of it. You should have been able to take care of them. What's that? Is that a kind of quirk? What's a quirk? Uh, you know what a quirk is? No. As Zuku gives his best explanation, well, at least the best explanation a four-year-old can give, well, them's... Oh, in that case, we don't have quirks. They just summon their swords. And it's like, How would you do that? Seriously, it looks like he really knows nothing. Hmm. So, you just wanted to help? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know about that. Why would you just want to help someone out the blue? Did you even, did you know them or something? Well, no. I just didn't want them to get hurt. No one's this nice. Huh? You must have been planning something. What? You must have been considering using them for some weird reason if you didn't use your quirk thing or your spirit energy. What's spirit energy? And I don't have a quirk. What? I'm quirkless. Well, I 
use it was to just don't play hero. But that's exactly what I want to be. Huh? Them just pretty much like, how are you going to be a hero without a quirk? And I was like, well, he could use his spirit energy, but he doesn't know how to use it. What's spirit energy? Uh, should we? I don't trust him. Hmm. Okay, how about this? We'll teach you some things, but... Hmm. What do you mean? Us uh, summoning our swords? We can teach you how to do that. But he doesn't have a sunpock gel. <sighs> I know, but or at least he can empower a wooden sword or something, right? Um, excuse me, but what's a sunpock gel? Nothing you need to worry about. Trust us. As, yeah. Izuku actually grows up with them. Them, thanks to their vast knowledge, training him how to use the spirit energy. Which, when it comes to him learning, this is when he notices things he didn't notice before, like, say, ghosts. Upon seeing them, he is actually both intrigued yet terrified. For a simple fact, I was like, uh, So ghosts are real? Yeah. Does everything surprise you? Well, I, I, I just didn't. I, I would have never believed that ghosts were actual ghosts. I, I've never seen one before until now. Listen, you, you you're gonna have to get more used to surprising things. You you can't just be shocked by everything, you know. I know this may be new to you, but you, you gotta learn how to keep your composure. Uh, all right, I can try. Good. Now show me your sword stance. Okay. Is yeah, they put Izuku through the ringer. Not enough to kill him, but enough so yeah, he's limping home. Inko does have questions like what are you being bullied? This no, this is training mom. <laughs> Uh, so it is. And this carries on up till the end of middle school. Where Izuku, he's pretty much feeling himself. He's all. He has a pretty good build. He's definitely not someone you want to pick on. If you can help it. Only thing is, Bakugo and the others don't know much about his. Training. If anything, you just see them as the same old Deku, just a bit more built. So they do laugh at him. But he just does not give a damn. He does not care if they laugh. He knows what he can do. He knows that he can easily beat all of them. So he just goes back to reading his little research notes. Being the wonderful Izuku we know and love. But underneath the surface, he's a beast. When it comes to Slugbillion, he already notices it and just keeps effortlessly dodging up until All Might shows up. When it comes to him grabbing onto All Might, that doesn't happen. He does not care. He knows he can be a hero thanks to all of his training. And as long as he keeps it up, yeah. No more hero? 
That spot is guaranteed. But when it comes to the whole All Might dropping a sludge villain, that does happen. The only thing is, when Bakugo gets captured, and they, he just sees Izuku, he does still look scared, but he's also more or less pissed. So, this is what Izuku is like, okay, yeah, this, this feels like karma. I could easily just let him die, but for some reason, still, there's a part of me that... Doesn't want that to happen. So he just walks up to him. Slow. Steady. Calm. It's, what are you... What are you doing? Please let him go. Uh, what? Please release your hostage. And no harm will come to you. Some people just laughing his ass off. Like, dude, dude all, only thing you did was dodge my attacks. <laughs> you have a replace cork or nothing else. What do you think you can do as he just splatters flat on the ground? Bago, he coughs up whatever sludge was there. As he just realizes, wait, what the hell? Everyone looking as Izuku, all he's doing is standing there, looking down at the sludge villain. Who's saying, What is this? How? Why can't I move? Why am I so scared all of a sudden? Move, Kotsky. You don't tell me what the, I said. Move. Or do you want to kneel before me too? I I'll give you five seconds. Kasi just bolting out of there. All the heroes, they're pretty much stunned. All my seeing this is like, what kind of quirk is that? But Sushbrillion is captured. He doesn't even put up a fight. He's just terrified he was Zuku. He's like, get that kid away from me. Because the ball goes like, I didn't need your help. Zuku just walks away. He doesn't, he doesn't even let the ball go finish his sentence. So, how did it go? Hmm. I, I've gotten better. Yes, I could, I could feel that. You got better at controlling it, definitely. So, you ready to help some spirits? Are you slowly but surely starting to trust me more? I'll take that as a yes. As yeah, pretty much, Izuku is helping them you can say unfinished business of good kind spirits spirits that have been wronged they're vigilantes <laughs> the first when they pitched it to him he was but that's against the law the law has failed these people the the law is what allows some of these villains to get away with what they did so why not us fix that thanks to the fact that we can actually talk to them interact with them we can at least make it so that they can pass on Zuku's pretty much like she makes a good sales pitch. So, yeah. When it comes to people learning about them, is uh, Izuku does let them know that, yeah, you guys are going to have to change your attire. You're going to have to be less revealing. Because as soon as he saw what they decided to wear, he was 
I just say he needs to make sure he doesn't uh be a blood transfusion with what some they uh, prefer to wear as hero costumes. But when it comes to righting the wrongs, people are actually split when it comes to that. On one hand, yes, they're doing good, but on the other hand, they're doing it outside the law. They could end up getting themselves or other people mixed up with it. It could be catastrophic. It's anarchy. It's not until the end of the 10 months. Izuku, he's pretty much like... Uh, uh, See you there, Mom. Inko. Which, yeah, she's still prime Inko, considering she's nowhere near as stressed because of Izuku. But at the very least, he does worry her when he comes back with cuts and bruises. Okay, just be careful. Don't worry, Mom. It's just, it's just a test. I got this. I believe you, I'm just, I just don't want you to get hurt. Don't worry mom, I can take care of myself, I'm more than strong enough. Are you sure? Yes. When it comes to the interest of them, Izuku is doing for hella well, he, he, there's no doubt in his mind. Mind, he had more than enough time to study. He's way more adapted to entertaining situations as well as robots compared to people. <laughs> he doesn't have to hold back. Though he doesn't want to use his wooden sword, he does enhance his body. And oh, it is devastating to see what he can do those robots with his bare hands to the point where all the teachers are hella impressed all my he's like wait what what's wrong is it I I thought he had a gravity quirk or something uh what's his quirk uh it says here he's quirkless what doing that just seeing the remains of fallen robots. Izuku just constantly getting more and more points. Oh my, it's like, no, no, that's impossible. For him to be able to do that without a quirk. Aizawa? I know what you're thinking. Yes, I've tried using my quirk, but it's hard to do from this distance. He has a way wider range some of the other participants are actually getting a little worried before I can tell yes this whatever he's using or doing is not a quirk what the hell is Ziku man I wish the others were here as yeah, they didn't care about UA. They didn't care about any of that. All these, uh, ugh. part of their whole motivation is getting revenge on Eisen, which they still can't. They don't know where the hell he is, as well as just trying to do good. <laughs> but uh, I wonder how he's doing it on his test. Oh, what's that? You you wish you were there to watch him and cheer him on? <laughs> of course not. I just don't want all of our training to go to waste if he fails. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> You're worried about him. <sighs> That's ridiculous. He's our student. That's all he is. So you say, but the way you make sure to hold back just enough so he doesn't get too hurt. Don't you remember he, his mom didn't want him to come up with a broken arm or anything? 
Yeah, but you could still, you know, apply more force. For some reason, you hold back. Why don't you just mind your own damn business? This is... Okay, okay. No need to get uh, defensive. I'm not getting defensive. 